So I'm sure I'm not the only person who's disappointed by Nintendo's themes on the Nintendo Switch. There's only two of them, and so well, right now there's only two of them, which is being a default white and a, and a grayish color. And I just think, well, that is, it's good to have two themes right at the default. The 3DS really missed on that. But I think we're all expecting something a little bit more than that. So I went into Photoshop and with very limited Photoshop experience, I decided to make some themes for the Nintendo Switch. So my first concept was uh, Joy-Cons. So we all have Joy-Cons. Here on my Switch, I have the neon blue and red ones. So I was thinking, what if there was a little gradient in between them? So I thought about that and I made a, a, a few Joy-Con colors. I made some themes for it. So this includes the uh, pink and green, the Animal Crossing ones, and the yellow and purple ones, just because those are some of my favorite ones. Now, I have been told that yes, I forgot about the Switch Lite when I made, I, I sent this post on Twitter and I did at the start forget about Nintendo Switch Lite users. That's okay because I've made uh, two of them. I've made the yellow Switch Lite, which looks here, and the red Switch Lite. I've made themes for those ones, so it's, you're not really missing out much. Great. Great Joy-Con users. Yes, hi, hello. Um, you're not, you're not forgotten. No, no, no. I've not forgotten you. Um, you guys got games. You guys got games, right? Um, th this, th this is a games, a game console. You guys got games. So, I've also made some themes based on some of the most popular games. So, I've got Animal Crossing, Breath of the Wild, Splatoon 2, and Mario Odyssey. They're on the screen right now. I feel like this would be a nice little bonus for people just buying a Switch and buying a game. Why not get a free theme with it? Just to, you know, show how much you love the game. Or just a nice little pre-order bonus or something. I would think it would work best as you buy a game digitally or physically. And similar to how you claim the golden coins for a physical game, you get the theme. Or you just get the theme when you get a game and it automatically adds, I don't know. Now, this can be for first party and third party games. I obviously just made them for first party because I like Nintendo, but I can definitely see some Borderlands, Bioshock, other third party games, themes. I don't know, I don't know a lot of third party games on the Switch. So, um, yeah, so that's another concept. You, you don't have games. That's, that's fine, um, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, let me grab something. Let me grab something. The, the Nintendo, I present to you the Nintendo 3DS. Do you remember the Nintendo 3DS and its themes? It had themes, it had a few of them. Built in at launch, it was like the basic, well, not at launch, had a white at launch. And then a few years later, they added basic colors. But you could also add your own, add, buy custom themes, which took about three years for them to make. So it's no surprise that Nintendo hasn't done it for the Switch yet. But there was a little app called the Badge Arcade. Tennis in the 3DS Badge Arcade, I don't have it on the 3DS, but the 3DS Badge Arcade allowed you to place badges on tiles on the home menu or on folders. So what I'm thinking is a sticker arcade. So you're allowed to place stickers wherever you want on folders. If they ever add folders. On the background anywhere. And you can set your own color and you can just place little 8-bit or 16-bit sprites from games. So I was thinking, you know, a lot of NES games have their own sprites, so you can just use the NES sprites. Or with Mario Maker 1 on the Wii U, there were many costumes for Splatoon or Animal Crossing. And even in Super Mario Odyssey, there are costumes for every sprite. And so in even 3D uh, World, I believe there were little sprites everywhere. So I believe this is definitely possible. Um, that's a short little concept video I have. Hope you enjoyed. Nintendo, if you're watching this, uh, fix 3D All-Stars. Give me a job and release Metro Prime 4. That's all I have to say. Thank you guys so much. Uh, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.